close enough for 10 years. Yes. Here we are tonight, okay, to take some time to talk about Mitch and Sienna basketball. But Mitch, just look at these people right here. They are all with you, whether you win or tie. <laughs> games, all right, and this house will dwindle to about 20. There's something that I think that Mitchell has that is going to bring to Siena College that is very, very, very important, and that he will never, ever embarrass this university, he will never, ever cheat, he'll never do anything that's going to embarrass his family. And I think that when you get a person like that to coach your young people as student athletes, okay, you got a super guy. He was guy. a mentor. He, he was the um, coach that gave me my first job. I was 23, and um, I mean, I, I learned the game and how to be a coach from rolling. So I mean, it's not—it's a relationship that's gone gone over 30 years. I, I do confide in him. I do talk to him a lot about basketball, but also about how to handle kids and uh, things other than basketball. What kind of things did, did you learn from him watching that coach that you have taken? Well, the one thing Rolly Massimino was, was a great teacher. He, he was a high school coach for 10 years. Uh, when I got to Villanova, he was he was there about five or six years. Uh, and I just learned a lot of basketball from him. Plus, I learned how to deal with kids. Rolly's a real mentor to a lot of kids. The other thing I learned is how to be a coach. I mean, he, he always used to tell me, if you're going to go far in the profession, you got to learn all aspects of coaching. And, you know, I think when I got the Siena job, you know, all those nights with him and dealing with people and really paid off. Mitch got the job in Siena. What was your reaction? I was really, really ecstatic. Uh, I was very proud and happy for Mitch because he worked so hard to, uh, to become the head coach. Uh, again, and he's done a wonderful job everywhere he's been, and uh, I'm proud of him. And what about the opportunity for him to take over a, an established mid-major program like Siena? Well, I'll tell you what, he'll be, he'll be great. Uh, there's no one that has any more passion, any more love. Uh, he will, he will be one of Sienna's best coaches, in my estimation, and they've had some great coaches. And uh, he will never embarrass Sienna. He's the most honest, sincere individual. Uh, and I've had, I got 26 guys out there that are assistant coaches and that became head coaches, and he's one of the best.